Constitutional expert Abdul Aziz Bari said it was a bad decision not to call parliament in 1969, and the decision should not be followed now. He said this in response to de facto law minister Takiuddin Hassan, who had pointed out yesterday that during the 1969 emergency, parliament did not sit for two years, but the government still continued to function. In a message to Malaysia Kini, Aziz said that until today, there were many questions surrounding the 1969 emergency, and the incident is still shrouded in mystery. This included who had advised the then Yandi Pertuan Agong to declare an emergency and on what grounds. The Perak DAP vice chairperson said that Tunku Abdul Rahman, in his memoir entitled Before and After May 13th, was critical of the whole thing. He added that in short, to rely on the emergency in 1969 may not be a good idea. Yesterday, Takiuddin had maintained that the government is functioning well even though parliament has been suspended through an emergency proclamation that came into force on January 11th. Takiuddin reiterated that parliament will only sit when the emergency expires in August. However, he also acknowledged that the emergency ordinance allowed parliament to be convened at any time deemed appropriate by the Yandi Pertuan Agong.